Hello everyone, welcome again to this incomplete series of videos for project managers. In this video, we will see how to create a project charter. But as always, we'd like to start with HSSE, health, safety, security, environment. We're out here in the environment and taking care of our health. We want to make sure we spend at least 120 minutes out in with nature following a study that was made that found that people have better health and are better well-being if they spend at least 120 minutes a week in nature. Outside of that, make sure you're not using your devices while driving. Stop and and make sure you're in a safe place. Or if there are alarms in your building, make sure you follow the process in the case of an alarm. Let's go back inside and take a look at the project charter. All right, we're back inside here with PowerPoint, the tool of choice. We usually uh, use this tool for presentations, for steering committee slides and it's just useful to have this project charter in the same format it can be used as uh, background slides for your ste steering committee slides that you create we have a video that we've done on that uh, if you want to go go back and look at that so here we're using the standard tools that powerpoint offers us to create this charter the background, you always want to give uh, your audience background of the project, scope, zero in on what it is that the project is going to do, and high risks, uh, things that to, for the folks to look out for. You want to have the steering committee be aware if there are any high risks to the project. So it took about 11 minutes or so to create this. I'm just fast forwarding through some of this. Here again, easy tools PowerPoint has to um, standardize the uh, headers of each area. So now we're gonna go into objectives, deliverables, and key activities. So now you're kind of zeroing in a little bit more on what you're going to do, what's the objective of the, of the project, um, what do you want to accomplish, maybe saving some money or enhancing some functionality. Deliverables are getting into now the details of what you're going to deliver as to make it a success. So. You want to spell that out and then a rough timeline in the key activities all right following um, and this is probably the standard information you can add more things but I've found that this is the basics that you need to to share with your steering committee Next sections, benefits, dependencies, team stakeholders, and costs. So very important, again, benefits, showing what the uh, project is going to give as benefits as return on investment. This is very important for the steering committee. Dependencies, if there are any, uh, making them more aware of what needs to happen as a prerequisite cost and team self-explanatory again details are very important here it shows that uh, if you make it nice and neat it shows that you care about the project and the quality of the work that you're doing outside of these uh, meetings so give it a, a good title normally it's the project name slash project charter clarifying what it is what kind of document it is 
Here we'll use proper font and I think we're just about done. I'll head back outside for another break. Here's your project charter. I'm ready to go. Not bad. Yeah. Nice. Oh yes, and it helps to work from home. I don't need to be dressed up or anything. Just in a t-shirt. That's all I need. I'll check you later.